everyone welcome back to my channel thank you so much for watching this video my name is Tommy and this is Tommy's color pavilion so very quickly today I have a previous video where I shared on a remedy on how to get rid of black spots on your face and have very clear skin and I have another recipe today sometimes when you see those videos it's just like different methods on how you can achieve a perfect look for your face we all want flawless skin right and I've been trying to work on my face for some time and I've been seeing great results I had to abandon so many things I've used in the past and I am all about natural products right now so I'm going to be sharing the things I've used which have worked for me and this is another method which I'm going to show you today and it is being and it is you using aloe vera and simply lemon you'll be surprised that this very simple ingredients that we see all around can be of tremendous help I have tried it and they are sure ways this is my skin presently I'm not wearing any makeup and I can see that my skin has really 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 improved so if you want to have very clear skin kindly keep on watching this video to see what I'm going to be doing and showing you very shortly so guys I have aloe vera here with me let me show you my aloe vera plants this is a natural aloe vera plant. I love this so much. It's used for so many skincare things. Aloe vera is very good because it helps to battle out acne on your face before it even forms. It removes pigmentation, marks, dark marks on your face, and all. So I'm going to be using the gel. I've just cut up a bit, and I just want to cut it open to remove the gel because it's the gel I need. So I have some gel here. I'll just scrape it out with this knife. So guys, I have my gel removed already and I have a lemon here I said I was going to be using aloe vera and lemon we all know the magic wonders of lemon for our skin it helps to also remove dark marks pigmentation it also helps to fight acne so that is why I'm combining these two ingredients today and I'll be using one half of a lemon I'll just cut it up and this one half of a lemon is equivalent to about one tablespoon so I'll just squeeze in my lemon with a strainer into this mix that I have. And I'm going to have my lemon and my aloe vera gel. I'm just going to mix it properly very well. It's gel and water. So I have to give this a very good mix so that it can match together so I think it's well mixed now there's no separation from the lemon and from the aloe vera gel everything is well mixed together so I'll just go ahead and apply it on my face so I can show you the process guys so with the help of my foundation brush and my aloe vera and lemon mixture. I'm just going to be applying a bit of this on my face. I've got quite an amount here. I'm very sure I won't use all this on my face, but the good thing about this is that when you mix it like this, you can store it up in your refrigerator for up to three days and you can continue using it morning and evening till when you use it all up. So it's good that you mix it up like this. You can store it up. When you're ready to use it, even with the way it's cold, it's very good because it's also going to help shrink your large pores. If you have large pores so that's another thing I do sometimes I purposely even put it in the fridge so that it's cold and with the way it is very cold just apply it in your face and it's also going to help you have that very flawless skin and help with your large pores as well so I'm just going to go ahead and apply this on my face the gel and everything The gel can be very slimy, so just take care on when you're applying it. Bear that in mind, it's going to be very slimy, but when you want to achieve something, you go all in for it. I don't care, it's just because of this video. I'm trying to be careful, but in normal day when I'm applying it on my skin, I just go like I do it in the bathroom and I don't really care. It goes all in my face, everywhere, and it's fine.
so guys i'm done with applying it all over my face i'm just going to wait for it to get dry for at least 10 to 15 minutes when it's dried i'll wash it off my face with cold water and i'll be back to show you the results another reason why i like using the aloe vera and lemon combination is because if you want your skin to glow if you want it to be bright this is the perfect thing you should do because lemon instantly brightens your face lemon tomato potato they are good lighting agents so if you want to eliminate dark marks from your skin if you feel that your skin is looking a little bit hashy dull you can use this to brighten up your complexion immediately and it really does work so i'll just keep it on my face for about 10 to 15 minutes if you wish you can keep it on for longer sometimes in the morning when i'm doing my chores i leave it for like 30 minutes then maybe when i'm having my bath i just take it all off all together but i'll show you how i'm going to take it i'm going to show you when i'm done taking it off and i'll just come back to you guys so i might do so please keep on watching guys so i'm back i've washed off the aloe vera and lemon mixture from my face i just did that with cold water and this is my face now so what i also do is to use my rose water i love rose water this is like my toner sometimes i even mix it in my body cream rose water is just that natural toner that you can use for your skin without any blemish no side effect it takes care of basically every kind of skincare need that you have as a toner so i like to use it as a toner so i'm just going to dampen a bit of rose water in my um cutting pad and i'll use it all over my face in circular motions like so So with this you remove every dead grit whatever that has been on your face gets away and what is more this is perfect for your skin it helps your skin break properly and it just helps all in whole so this is my skincare regimen one of my skincare routines and it's very good if you look if you're looking for that flawless skin you don't want your skin to have acne mats blemishes this is what you can do just use your aloe vera and your lemon and use your rose water afterwards it's not compulsory to use rose water just in case you don't have but i think it's essential so this is what i do this is how i achieve my almost flawless skin is not yet so flawless i'm still trying to get there i still want it to be better than this but where i'm coming from is a long journey like i left that a long time ago it was terrible i struggled but now i'm getting better skin if you love this video kindly give this video a thumbs up kindly share and if you've not subscribed to my channel yet kindly subscribe for more videos and don't like come your way guys thank you so much for sticking around bye and stay beautiful